children all as well. My first guest tonight is one of the executive directors of the Mutual of Omaha's Wildlife Heritage Center. He's also a correspondent for the Today Show. Ladies and gentlemen, it's always a pleasure having him here when he brings his freaky animals around. Please welcome Jim Fowler. My God, look at this thing. Welcome, Jim. Welcome. You know, the audience isn't going to get hurt. It's just you, Conan. I mean, I would <laughs> never. They want to see that. I want to yeah. tell you something here, though. This is, I'm going to turn this, uh, your fear into fascination. How's that? Okay. Okay. You're a little late. Yeah. I just wet myself when We're I saw this thing. But <laughs> what, what, this, this is, a, that. that's okay. That's just a microphone. We don't need that. Where's um, that celery? This is, uh, this this, is, tell us what it is. Well, this is one of the most amazing things in the uh, Does he like it when kingdom. you do that? Is he... he doesn't have a choice, tell the truth, but look. <laughs> this is how I he wanna... gets tossed out of a bar when he's had too much to drink. You. Come on, get out of here, you giant 900-pound turtle. Some things are living in some of the ponds and creeks right here in this country. No, yeah. this doesn't come from this country, does it? Yeah. This thing's sell. on steroids or something. This, <laughs> this it... is the snapping turtle. Do you have that piece of celery we over there? We always keep celery back here for guests, yeah. but look. you can... <laughs> Just happen to have it. I want to show you yeah. something because this was for Fabio if he comes on. They yeah. have a fascinating. You never know. He likes to be fed. If you'll touch the what? If you'll touch this carefully, that's touch long this enough, right, right here. No, right around his mouth. I want to open uh, his mouth. I'm right. dumb, but what do you? No, come no, on, you're take... the one that said I had all these freaky animals here, not me. Okay, what do I do? I well, touch where? Touch, touch right around the mouth, and we're going to see if he. Don't get your hand near it now. Wait just a minute, wait a minute. Touch his mouth, but don't get near just, it? Just what do you mean? Celery. Oh, just the, the celery. celery. Okay. Uh, Looky! There you go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, let, me, let me try something from this side. Does taunting him help? No, I want to show you the size of this mouth. Okay? okay. We'll see if he opens it up. Well, he seems like he's not going to do it. All right. But anyway, I want to show you. <laughs> You're on television, Jim. Know, Make I something know. happen. Hey, little turtle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There you go, there you go. All right, put it in there. Ah, ah, there you ah, that was, uh, oh. You seem to communicate better than I do with these, yeah. Yeah, yeah taunting helps. I'm anyway, there's a, there's a lure right under the tongue. It's uh -huh. fascinating. And it, it's used to catch fish. There right. you can see it. Now, if say that did catch yeah. my hand, what would uh, happen? Well, they say that they won't let loose until it thunders. So uh, you are in big trouble. Right, but could it and rip so, my hand off? And blood would shoot completely. out off the stump and but spray again, the audience? The more, would that actually happen? It could happen, but I don't think we'll take a chance on it. Anyway, I'm trying. <laughs> anyway, I think we've got some other fascinating things to show you. Okay, can we so put this in a steel vault put or something? Put this right over there. Oh. John Morris, okay. friend of mine, will come. He works with you? He's not just a random guy? No, John is the real expert on this. In hey, fact, uh, see you. How are if you? he hadn't opened his mouth, John would have been in trouble. Okay. Okay, all right. What's next? Now we've got a... back here, yeah. Okay. This, I think, is really interesting. And, I'm uh, not as scared of this one as no, I was of the earlier one. That's true. Hold this like that. Like this? Down a little bit. D down? Just lay it down on the table. Oh, like that. There you, you go. You and I have trouble communicating. I've I know. It, I know. It. We'll get better here. Okay. I mean, uh, hold now you're that. Just, hold this. All right. Now, I want to let you help me dry this off. This is a uh, very unusual tree frog. Okay. And you just... The, if you'll dry that off, you don't. Dry mind. him off. Yeah, a little bit, okay? There you go. By the way, there are very few people. I wouldn't do this for most most people. You know that? Huh? I wouldn't do this for most people, but for you, okay. we're going to try this. Okay, what right? do we do? Not many people have ever dried off a tree frog. Now, put him right here on the glass. I want to show you. Put him on the glass. Well, okay. you can put him upside down. I'm going to put this one the other way around. Oh, his buddy. But I want to show you how incredible these are. These are capable. You can hold this now. Okay. Straight up. Okay. Now turn that around and give the camera. This is a an unusual frog. <laughs> I don't guess you can turn it around that way. Yeah. What? What? What, what do go. I do? What, am I like doing something this. wrong? I dried them go. off real. Show the suction. Oh Isn't my that God! A beautiful that. That's, that's pretty incredible. They are. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I got. And also hold Wait that a minute. one. Hold that one right there. Now just sit still here. And we're going to put that right like that. See? <laughs> All right. Now let's put that back here. <laughs> oh, it's pretty good. Fearless. You're absolutely, you're absolutely fearless. All right. Now, if you think that's something. You didn't do that at rehearsal, Jim. <laughs> 
You saved that one. Too much makeup. Okay, now uh, what if happens? I think that's something. I want to show you one of the greatest animals in the world here. Okay. Of course, is uh, is the lion. This is what Jug I like here. just before the monologue. They have to. Here oh, go, there guy. we. Come on. Oh man. All right, come uh -huh. on, guy. This is a little guy. How old is this one, Andy? Andy Simmons. Seven and a half months. Seven and a half months. All right. And uh, no, well, the point and is. That, what that, is that? That's meat for it right there. That's meat, but I want you to bring this pan over here because we're going to feed this little guy. He's, uh, unfortunately, lions in Africa are a bit in trouble. Mm -hmm. Don't want to move that camera too much. Okay. And just put the whole pan down here by him, Conan. Yeah. Not put, one piece at a time, the whole put pan. Put the whole pan and then right, run away. Right where right? the bottle is. Okay, right there. Closer, Look closer. at that. Huh? There you meat? go. Meat? There you go. See? All right, that's okay. good. Okay. No. Happy. Lions are, are competitors. They're competitors, yes. A lot of these at this age don't survive, I hate to say, in Africa because mm -hmm. it is, it's, it's, it's really a jungle out there. It's not yeah. that, that easy. Right. But I wanted to show you this one because we've got to make sure that we provide room for this. Oh, uh, well, he's just and sucking down 80 pounds of meat like I've right. never seen anybody do before. That's, well, a, that's really impressive. You, that was a bowl filled with like tons of meat and he just inhaled it. You should see what the snapping turtle could have done. That's, no, that's anyway, very impressive. You're right, it is. Well, this will eat... Uh, what does he hunt in the wild? It's not bowls of meat. I mean, no, what, this what is... Little guy, <laughs> this little guy... Bowls of meat running along the savanna. <laughs> this little guy doesn't do, you know, too much, but uh, in the wild, of course, this can take down large things like buffalo. Up right. Four or five what about pounds. him and me right now? What would happen? Who would win? Well, while he's eating, uh, he would win. You would lose. Right. Andy, is he all finished there? Yes, Yeah, okay. Very cool. Uh, what is with the bottle on that? What yeah. does that do? Does we'll that show you the... He gets very competitive, and that's why you have to be careful about it. Okay. We don't recommend people having anything like this as pets, of course, but as an... As, <laughs> I think, duh, as is an, an appropriate pet. thing to say, Jim. As a... Well, you'd be amazed... Having a killing man-eater in your home is probably not the best idea. Well, you'd be amazed the people who try it, but it's, okay. this is an ambassador for the natural world. And there's very cool. a lot of reasons to see it. We're running out of time, okay, so... Okay, we got one fast over okay, here, Okay, what do you want us to do over here? I'm going to make quite a wide arc around this animal here. Yeah. Okay, we, uh, great. You mentioned something about danger. Yes. Uh, this is for real. John Loris is one of the few people around. Hold that lid, if you will. Hold the lid, okay. Uh, John's one of the few people around who works a lot with poison snakes. That is a rattlesnake right there. And that it's is a rattlesnake, that's right. John, okay. where is our... What do I do, close we it? We notice... Yeah, you can shut that now, okay? Ah, uh -huh, guy. Where's our glass? There's the glass over here. This right here. This has very seldom been done on television. We're going to show how to melt... You know, melt... for good reason, probably. Well, you're, yeah. a, you're a perfect person to do this with. Right. Show so how I... to melt a rattle signal. Hold it like this and hold the tip of that very This carefully. is great with Kahlua. Hold it way. solid now, John. Hold it solid. What? Hold it go. solid? The glass. Hold it still. I'm right? holding it as still okay, as I can, go. but this thing is a... It's... Now, that, now watch oh! the... Oh! Then I'm going to Oh, my God! Now, don't do this at home, <laughs> Uh, John, you better be careful with your fingers there now. Now that stuff is... Shows you the... That's yeah. pure death. That's the glass of death I'm holding. Is that right? You aren't kidding. In fact, let me have that glass. I think I'll make sure that it's taken care of. Actually, this is a foreign protein. If you didn't have ulcers, you could drink this. I don't want to encourage you. That's too okay. Anyway, one again, nature is equipped in fascinating ways. We have tremendous biodiversity. Okay. We shouldn't just be afraid of things. We need to learn about them. Okay. okay. They could stop. <laughs> <laughs> This is the Eastern Diamondback Rattle, and Jari has a place called the Pocono Snake and Animal Park. And you'll see this on, uh, I gotta get another, <laughs> I gotta get another plug in here, you know, we're doing with Discovery Channel, yeah. called the Animal Planet. It's okay. gonna be all animals all the time. All right, I was gonna mention that at the end. I, I hope you were. Yeah. All right, is that it? Are we, are we about, we're, what's we that, do the owl, more. we got yeah, time for the owl? Good, let's, let's do, do the owl, would you, right. hey, <laughs> go away. All right. Why don't you put that? Oh, that one goes in there. Okay. Well, I would do it myself. Ah! Yeah! Come on, I like it when they're in a big box. No. What's this now? Well, this let me is guess. A, an owl. You'll find this in uh, Central Park. Okay. Uh, let me we'll find move a lot of behind there, you yeah. there. That's good. <laughs> Okay. Stand but over where do here. I go? You stand over there. Okay. I just want to show you one of the amazing creatures. Uh, what do I do? Don't worry, it's not going to go at, at your throat. <laughs> okay. See the call? This is what you can hear if you listen quietly, because it's found all over America. Mm -hmm. Now, we're going to see if it'll go back to the box. The box simulates a tree. Okay. You've got to hold that. 
Hold, from each I side. Me to hold the John, box. did you show him how to pick that up and hold it? Hold I don't it. Know how to hold the box? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Just, just hold it like what? Andy, like, what about this towel here? What do I do? Get that hold off. this right. like this? That's right. That's right. All right. And open the door. And I'm, this is this is simulating a tree. You got to open the door. Well, no, they go in the hollow tree. Open the door. Okay. They go into hollow trees. That's right. right. Open it up. Okay. There you go, guys. Whoa! There you go. How about that? Pretty good. He's real well trained. Very nice. Uh, <laughs> very well done. That's uh. They like. They feel safer in a place like that. Yeah. No, I can understand why. I feel safer yeah. with them in there, actually. I, I would think so. But you see, you got to get over your. Just kick that fear. around. You got to get. What do you like at the fear? airport? <laughs> Hey, listen. And this thing sets off the alarm. Open that up. Let's we, take a look in there. Come on, let's we, see it. Let's go, have, pal. We have big problems in this country today because we're all disconnected from nature. We got to learn about it. Then it's not so frightening. Of course, with you, well, I don't know. Well, seeing a uh, seeing that snake milked of its venom right. made me much less frightened. Of it. <laughs> that helped a lot. All right, Jim thank Fowler, right. thank you very much. Thank nice you. to have you with us. Thank Colin you. Quinn, Fowler's yeah, yeah. coming up. We'll be right back.